I heard they're nerfing Gecko. They're probably making it so his alt is harder to... Um, okay. I have I have an opinion about Gecko. I'll, I'll show I'll show it real quick. Just okay, it binds like one map that people always play Gecko on. But um, okay, if if people didn't know, this is how Gecko's ult works. For an example, what is it? Is it a, it's a seven point ult, right? Seven point ult, and um, you're able to obtain alt orbs in rounds that you have used your ult. Um, not only the fact that you're like planting all the time and you could also just be grabbing every single orb you see. So you have your ult like so many times. Um, it's kind of ridiculous. Let's say for an example, let's say I have my ultimate this round, right? Uh, let's do just full cheats right now. Okay. So let's say I have my ult this round and we go showers, right? And now let's say... Um, okay, I throw my ult, like, however, you like this, you throw your ult. There's a dude right here. I detain, kill this dude. Kill. That's one orb right there. While my ult is still in use in this round, I grab this orb right here. I pick up my ult again. And then maybe, like, someone just wide swings me right here. I get another kill. I throw my thing for a plant. I'm four out of seven right now. I'm four out of seven. And then... Maybe again in the round, I use my ult again. Someone's around this corner. I do this. It's like last person. I kill them. Now I'm five out of seven for next round. Five out of seven for next round. So that's the issue with Gecko's ult is you obtain ultimate orbs while your ult is in play. And because you can have two ults in play in a round, you can get all orbs like way too fucking quick. So I think they need to do that where until his like second ult is used, you don't get orbs. But I do think they should increase the power of Thrash. Like maybe make it a little bit faster, make it a little bit like tanky or something. So it's more self-sufficient, but you shouldn't be able to do this and go into the round. Like getting one ult orb, a 3K and getting a plant will literally put you five out of seven. You need two more orbs for the round. I go fucking shower default again. I grab the orb. I have, I'm six out of seven. We go reclear long. I grab my orb here. We're seven out of seven. I use my ult again for the site. And then the same exact thing happens. I'm 7 out of 7 after using my ult last round. Right here. I do this. Someone's mid sight. Detain them. Throw my fing plants. Get a kill here. I go back sight right here. Play like an off angle. And then someone swings me. I kill them. They trade out. What am I? 4 out of 7 now? Bro, this character like needs to be fixed. I'm. F Bro, I did that and now I'm 4 out of 7. <laughs> uh, it it's, it's too broken. But. The thing is, I think they need to take away the power from spamming the ult and give the the actual thrash itself more power. I think they should make it so you get it, um, and it's just like like a, a like a Hulk of a fucking dog. Like this thing just does more. Like it maybe goes a little bit faster, so you don't have to like always have a brim with you, so they can stim up the thrash. Or maybe they make it so like it has like a sufficient more HP because if you use your thrash, right? It's kind of like an underwhelming ult, but also like a good ult at the same time. The The good part is, if people are stuck in corners and stuff, you can like pre-fire at around corners and people just get detained. And there's nothing they can do. But on the other side of it, if someone is right here and you throw your ult and they're top sight, one, two, three, four bullets and your ult's just dead from Vandal. Uh, so that's kind of the thing that's... Um, the ult is both really good and really bad at the same time, but you can always spam it. So most of the time, it's like most of the time using good scenarios. I think that I personally did in pro. I, I don't really know like how many other people do this, but I definitely use Gecko in a more unique way. But I would love playing contact setups where my teammates would be like holding like this with me. And I basically sit here with my ult and listen to how fast the deploy to the launch is. Ready? You see how fast that deploy is after uh, like, bro, I need like a timer or something. But I would, I would literally do this. I'd sit behind a corner and then Gustavo would hold for me off of Gustavo's contact. I would literally instant use my ult and instant lunge it into people. Obviously, my ult's not that great at the moment because I'm like fucking washed at doing this. But um, I would be able to get it off really fast. I think I even did it like this. I don't even think I stayed in the corner fully. I just did it like that. And it was really OP. I'd get, I would detain like two or three a lot of the times. It was really broken. But people don't understand like the power of thrash in that essence. Um, if you know someone's like 
close spawn. Obviously, it's like kind of a gamble doing it like that. But um, let's say you're like mid site and something that's spammable. If you know that someone's like here at spawn, literally just popping it and just fucking like sending it at them right away. Like this thing is so fast. But yeah, I just don't, I don't think when when you have a character that can use like five ultimates and a half you're basically playing overwatch now and i think valorant should not be overwatch valorant should be valorant but it, this character adds too much chaos and too many ultimates so they do need to nerf that but they should make it have more hp or make it have more speed or something it's my personal opinion so that's probably why they're saying like adjusting agents like gecko they're not saying like nerfing gecko but they're, they'll probably reduce that just because that's the main reason that gecko's played in the first place is in pro play you can just get fucking 30 ults like at all times especially with uh map control and orb maxing there's certain maps as well where uh the orbs are just so favored on one side so a lot of people like play gecko i mean that's kind of like bind binds are really like i would say attacker orb sided um you can always get the shower orb you can always get the long orb it's like scary to get it on the defense 